Good evening, Guam. I'm Jess Luhan. Welcome to this edition of The Buzz. We're continuing a conversation, of course. We're talking to the Matau. We have team captain Jason Cunliffe and midfield and striker number 21, uh, Marcus Lopez. We're going to be talking about their recent game in Turkmenistan. And, and uh, actually, we're going to be looking at some clips and we doing some color commentating on critiquing yourselves. Uh, Jason, hey, good evening. Jason. Good evening. Good to good be back here. Good evening, Marcus. Good evening. But I, I tell you what, let's go straight into the clips and... Uh, Let's comment on this. So here, here, here it is. Here's a, a little graphic here, and then we'll continue with this. So Jason, this is, uh, this is the field um, in Turkmenistan? Yes, this Take is uh, Ashgabat Stadium um, in the capital. Uh, pretty decent field. Pitch was a little heavy, played a little bit slow, but the atmosphere itself was, was unbelievable. Um, as you can see, a packed house, I think, uh, might have been 25,000 plus. So. Um, a great experience for us. Here is uh, our pregame ritual, say in the Inafresi. Um, this is right in the uh, hallway, right before we lead out to walk out onto the pitch. Now the guys in the pink, uh, number one, th those are your goalies, yeah? Correct, yeah. that was uh, Doug yeah. Herrick. Mm -hmm. and this is the view of the stand, basically. And um, unfortunately, we don't have any Guam fans there other than the, uh, the staff that was manning, uh, that was helping you guys, yeah? Yeah, yeah, exactly. <laughs> Talk yeah. about uh, us against the whole... The nation. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. And in showing this, what, 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 I, what I want the people to, to uh, Guam to, to see is this is what you guys are up against when you go. I mean, this it's not the Super Bowl. It's not the World Series. These are World Cup, uh, again, qualified stadiums. Right. And they're packed with mostly, again, um, <laughs> I mean, yeah. not our fans. Right, yeah. <laughs> yeah. The, the home and away series, it definitely, obviously, the away matches for us, um, you know, it's they're difficult every single time we go out there, so... Uh, we, we enjoy being home. You know, we have a match later this month, uh, or in November, excuse me, against Iran at home. So mm -hmm. hopefully we can get some more support like we've been getting so we can uh, mm -hmm. treat them how they somewhat treated us there. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> there we go. And obviously you're, you're, you're pledging, basically that's the, the, the Guam hymn. The, right, yeah, right. Okay. Yeah. yeah, they do the Fenogi Chamorro, obviously. Mm -hmm. um, everyone stands in respect for the national anthems. And then this is the uh, coin toss between the captains and the photo with the officials. Okay, okay. So the officials are two in the ends, right? Yeah, all, yeah. all, all, oh, all of them. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Okay. oh, yeah. Okay. Okay, and here, here we go, the start of the game, yeah? Pitch, yeah. Yep, corner kick, Alex Lee. Free header. There's Ryan. Yep, <laughs> our very own Ryan guy. You can see he's not very happy with himself because he had a clean look at it and if we could choose anyone in our <coughs> team to be in that position, it's definitely Ryan. He's the strongest in the air force. Uh, he, yeah, he, he told me about this. He says, man, I had a guy. <laughs> ah, <he's> yeah, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so this is us building out of the back, <clears throat> spreading wide to our wingers. Good running forward. Now, now this, this field that you're playing on, is, 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 this, is this grass or is that turf? It's grass. That's grass. It's grass, yeah. Okay. And um, here's one of our long throws. Oh, switch it up. Good ball into the box. Now, now what is the strategy here? Because I, I remember the, in the games here, uh, in the first games here against Turkmenistan, and uh, I think it was uh, India as well, right? Right. Uh, yeah. When, when, when there, there, there were throw-ins, and throw-ins towards, towards, the, towards the goal there. What was the object there to try to, uh, and, then, and then eventually there was a score. Right. Yeah. So what, what's, what's the object there? What, what, what's the strategy to, that you try to do there? I mean, because Ryan has such a long throw, we can we can create basically a corner kick. And anytime you can put the ball in the box in a dangerous area, any kind of bounce, anything can happen. As you saw, you know, we were able to, uh, they actually scored an own goal because of the pressure mm -hmm, that mm -hmm, the mm -hmm. the throw-in had. So, yeah, it's just, it's creating an opportunity. Put mm -hmm. the ball as close to the goal as possible, mm -hmm. see what happens. That's a great shot by Brandon, though. Yeah, absolutely, yeah, right there. Good play. Nice build up, lay off the top of the box. Brandon with a good oh. hit. No, for sure, this match um, as a team was our, our best performance altogether. Um, and it's, while the result wasn't what we wanted, it's definitely something to build on. And uh, mm -hmm. we plan to do just that. This is me taking a corner. The referee telling me to hurry up and take the corner. I didn't have a ball. <laughs> Seriously, that's what he's telling me. He's like, hurry up, take the corner, take the corner. That's what I was telling him. I was like, I don't even have a ball, bro. <laughs> yeah, give me a ball. Yeah. <laughs> Ooh, that was good. 
So these, these are their national players as well. And we, again, you know, just give you an indication. Look at that stadium there. Look at, look, look at that stadium. There's about 20, 25, 30,000 there. Okay? Yeah, you're only seeing one segment there. Okay? Yeah, and if you, if you notice, they're all color coordinated. They're all wearing like their own uniforms. It's actually quite interesting. Hmm. Or maybe they're from different villages. Yeah, I don't know. Yeah. <laughs> I, th I think they actually might be all sportsmen as well. Mm -hmm. Oh, really? Okay, yeah. okay. Yeah. So, so actually, so they're look, looks, looks like they're wearing tracksuits right, as well, right? right? Yeah, yeah, okay. Now, I don't know if you caught the picture of the dictator riding a bicycle. Oh, oh the dictator is riding a bicycle? Yeah, oh, yeah. In, in, in the middle of the field. Oh, okay. There's a big picture of him. Oh, okay, okay, yeah. Wow, okay. So this this stadium, I, my, you know, we we spoke to Gary, uh, um, Coach Gary, last week. He said this stadium. I mean, this is one of the, uh, this is this is one of their. Uh, I mean, the, the dictator's masterpieces. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> in to, yeah. In the stadium. Yeah. No, so, it's it's uh it's right in the middle. Um, Ashgabat actually is a very, very interesting city. We didn't get to see too much of it, but the mm -hmm. downtown area was very nice, very clean. Mm -hmm. Now, is that uh, okay? You, you see the red. Is, is that a is that a track? Is that a is that yeah, a, a running a track. track as well? Yeah. Athletics is like a, mm -hmm. a bit big there, so they promote it all day on the on the TV while we we're there. Okay, is this uh, is this uh, this particular uh, arena that you're at? Is this a multi multi-purpose stadium? Yeah, multi I mean, I mean stadium? it's it's yeah. specifically a soccer field, but obviously they have a Track and track field. field. Yeah. yeah. Okay. So so basically, it's not youth. I mean, they don't play baseball over there right, or right, American right. football. So other than track, uh, you know, again, football right. is their is their 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 major their major sport over there. Okay. Here we got a good look at a free kick. Once again, you know, putting the ball in the box in the dangerous position. Seeing what happens. Good ball by Ryan. Good header. And this one, uh, and, and Guam zero. So the, Turkmenistan had already scored. They scored in about the 20th minute. 20th minute, okay. Um, okay. Gave the ball away cheaply in the midfield. And, mm -hmm. uh, mm -hmm. Now, now ex explain to our viewers here, towards the, towards the end of the game, when you're about uh, five minutes to, to the conclusion of, 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 of the game, they would come up and say, there's three minutes tacked on to the game, four minutes, whatever it be. What is that a result of? Uh, that's just extra time. It's due to uh, substitutions, any injuries, um, where stoppage of play. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So they all add that together and say, right. hey, to the end, we're going to throw this an, a, another three minutes tacked onto the game, right? Right. Okay. Okay. Now explain to us uh, again. We, this is this is uh, soccer football 101 here in Guam. Explain the difference between yellow cards versus red cards. How many yellows uh, constitutes a red? Two yellows in a match constitutes a, a red. A, yeah. a red. Okay. So, uh, so a, a yellow card means what? What, is that, what does that mean? Yeah, what, so what kind of infraction is that? Uh, it can be a tackle. It can be an intentional handball. Um, but yeah, it's a fairly, you know, it's a warning just to let the player know one more, pretty much hard One more foul. from that player. Right. Not necessarily one more from another player. Right, right, okay. from that okay. specific player. So a red card, that's a major infraction, right? Yeah, absolutely. A red card is what? What is, what is that? Uh, uh, dangerous play, you know, like, physical confrontation, striking someone, obviously, um, anything like that, just two-footed hard tackles. Mm -hmm. Now, if you're in a tournament and you get a red card, do, do, do they take it out on, on uh, maybe a next game or something like that? If you have a three or four game series? Or right, right. Maybe? If you get a red card, you have at least a one game minimum suspension. And if they, they view it and deem it as like a, a major infraction, right, then yeah. it can be multiple game suspensions. Yeah. But, but can you appeal that? Yeah, is there an, is there an appellate process? That there there is an appellate process, um, but yeah, you have to go through the channels, um, the appeals committee, and it would take time. So you would still have to sit games while you were waiting for the appeal. Also, oh, I mean, so it may not it may not be that next game that that uh, that uh, they impose that penalty on you. It may be games, but then they they. How, how are you restored back? How are you made whole back after that once if you, you win once the appeal? You, well, if you win the appeal, then you're right away rein, reinstated. Okay, okay. Yeah. Okay. Okay. So we're still, again, this is the field in, uh, this is, this is the, the uh, Guam national uh, soccer team uh, playing the Turkmenistan nation, national team as well. And here's right. Marcus coming on, yes. Marcus, the there you go, Marcus minutes. Lopez <laughs> coming on as a sub. And you're sub, sub, subbing for who now? Who are you subbing um, for? Justin, Justin, yeah, Justin, Justin Lee. Lee. Justin Lee. Yeah. Okay, great. And yeah, that's uh, Darren, right? Uh, 
Yeah. Okay. You know what? We're going to take a quick break, guys. Come back, and we'll talk more about this. And that's the clip, of course. That's the uh, the uh, field in Turkmenistan as you guys took on the whole country. Yes, sir. <laughs> we'll be right back.